I want to explain something to the leftists and their minions and all the rest of you, okay? N number one, you're not leftists. Number two, you are absolutely nothing but useful idiots manipulated with a corporate template that's basically identical worldwide and that's used to destabilize countries and destroy a middle class so that people are permanently poor and stupid and under globalist control. This is their admitted plan under the Royal Commission in 1949. And everything after that is a regurgitation. Cloward and Piven, uh, just all, all of this stuff where they admit we want you austere. We want you not having anything so we can permanently control you. In Tragedy and Hope, Carol Quigley writes about this in a book, a secret book for the State Department and the CIA that was later published. None of this is my opinion. Now, the media is continuing to freak out saying, oh, my God, the president of the United States follows Alex Jones's worldview. No, that's not what's happening. As much as I'd love to say that Donald Trump's getting his information from me, maybe 10% of it, he's not. He's getting it from top generals. He's getting it from top people in banking. Because, folks, if you actually read globalist publications, they admit all this. They just put their spin on it that it's good. So the reason people are so frightened hearing Donald Trump like the mouth of Alex Jones is it's not I'm the first person nationally to actually break all this down and roll out how it really works. This isn't my perspective on things. The globalists are selling this soft, stupid race division, sex division, nanny state, political correctness garbage. And they're selling a system of more student loans and more debt and more, you know, payday loan facilities and more more rental centers and more permanent renter class. That's their admission. Huge screw jobs where you pay more for a 200 square foot apartment than you do for a thousand foot because the city passes a law. They've done it now eight different major cities. Austin's one of them to rip you off. They go, look, it's liberal. We just screwed you hardcore. You're like, thank you. It's trendy to live in a coffin and pay more than a thousand foot square. They have you paying more for a jail cell than a normal size, decent apartment. 